Hey you guys, what's up? I know it has been forever and a day. I don't even know if any of my subscribers are still here, but if you are, hey. Um, I know it's been like what, like almost a year since I've been on here and as you can tell, um I've gained weight. I've gained most of my weight back. I did. Um there is no excuse, no rhyme or reason. I just fell off the wagon. I ran away from the wagon. I got burnt out. And because I got burnt out and I added a few more things onto my schedule, I just put myself and my health on the back burner. So you live and learn, and now I'm trying to dust myself off and get myself back on the wagon. So um, last week, for the past couple of months, I've been trying to do it. I just was trying to get my schedule together because my schedule has been crazy. I'm back in school full time. So, you know, working full time, being a parent, you know, school, life, whatever, you know, it happens. So that's what's up. So I finally think I have a schedule that I can work with. I've been working with it for the past week, maybe two weeks, and it, it really works for me. So I will be doing my schoolwork in the morning because I'm not a morning person. I try to work out in the morning. It just is it. it it's not me. I am not the get up 5 in the morning, put my clothes on, and just get up and work out. Mm -mm, not me at all. So what I will be doing is um, doing my schoolwork in the morning and working out in the evening. I will be working out Monday through Thursday. Um, I will be working out every other Saturday um, so that I can get a little extra workout in. Of course, I'm going back to low carbon and as much as possible, meal prepping, everything. Like, I'm going back to the basics, basically. Um, so, today is Sunday. And, of course, you know, just like before, I'll be on here every Sunday giving you guys the tea of how what's going on with me for the week or whatever. And, of course, my way in. Um, hopefully, uh, with me coming back on YouTube and... Um, which was very hard because I really did not want to come back on here and show you guys, you know, that I kind of like failed. Not kind of like I failed. <laughs> <clears throat> All that hard work, you know, I was very depressed about that. About seeing my old videos and seeing pictures of me after I had lost the weight and once I got to my goal weight, which um, the smallest I was was 213. And now I'm back at this weight that I said I would never be back at. So it took a lot for me to even come on here and to admit that. And then to admit it to myself. And just recognize it. Acknowledge it. So, yeah. And a lot of people were looking up to me and, you know, asking me questions. And now it's like, you know, look. This is what happens when you run away or fall off the wagon. And you get burnt out. So I literally got just burnt out about everything, y'all. Just every single aspect of this weight loss journey. I got burnt out. I literally got burnt out. So, you know, whoever I've been watching before, I was watching you guys. I was just in the shadows watching and admiring. and Like, oh my God, that was me. Whatever, whatever. But, you know, I finally just got myself together and was like you know what you just gonna have to swallow this pill and you just gonna have to get it together and hey just face the music basically so that is what I'm doing right now I'm facing the music so um again I will be on here every Sunday giving you guys my way in and all the goody goods of my week blah blah um this week um I weighed in, might as well say for the first time. My doctor weighed me and stuff, so um, his scale, I think, is wrong, but whatever. Um, I'm going to tell you what I weighed in at my job. Um, I am back at, I'm starting at 246.6, yes, 246.6 pounds that number hurts and it sucks but I've conquered that number before 
I've gotten out of the 240s before. I am 6.6 .6 pounds away from being out of the 240s. So I'm going to bust my behind and get to it. So, yeah, because I have my doctor on my booty. <laughs> he, like, ripped me a new asshole when I went to see him at my doctor's appointment. So, um, because he know all the hard work that I've done, and he doesn't want me to go back to where I was. And that was, you know, my sugar being out of control and me on medication and stuff like that. So, um, we will be seeing each other every two weeks for the next two months. My doctor has ordered me to see him every two weeks. Um, another thing that has happened as well, besides me school and gaining weight and all this other stuff here. Um, when I was trying to get back on the grind of losing weight back in January I had a bit of a scare where I had um some heart issues so come to find out I have a little something something going on with my heart so I have to watch out for that but he said I could still work out just as much as I did before I just have to pace myself and and be aware and really look at my heart rate monitor and really make sure I don't go too hard you know so I told him, I was like, hey, once I'm on it and my mind is focused, then I'm going to go hard in the paint. And he's like, yeah, but watch your heart. <laughs> so that's about it. Um, I was in the hospital overnight. Um, I have to do another echo on my heart and make sure everything's okay, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, so, and that's another thing. That's another reason why he wants to see me every two weeks as well, just to make sure everything's okay with my heart and me losing weight and stuff like that so losing weight will help my heart as well so it all works and it all comes together right so yeah so um i'm back to working out at home doing turbo fire or whatever i want to do zumba whatever i don't care i'm just gonna be working out and this week i'm trying to work out for 40 minutes every day monday through thursday um low carb like i said drinking a gallon of water a day Watch what I eat. I'm not eating after 7. I weigh in on Fridays. And that's it. So that's what I'm going to be doing. So I will see you guys next time. I appreciate all the love and support. Um, and uh, that's it. So follow me on Instagram if you want to know more. Or want to follow me. Because that's where I normally put all my information. Like pictures and stuff of my my workouts and all that good stuff so follow me on instagram 2sweet504 and i'm also on my fitness pal as well under 